Alright, this is Twilight Prince 123, back with more Mistile. Alright, this place is going to be a little bit confusing, so I'm going to try my best to get to get it done. Now, I'm also trying out a slightly new, slightly different um, microphone setup, so tell me if it sounds a little bit better or not. Now, instead of heading up this time from the block puzzle, which I had to do over again, we're supposed to head right. And if we head up this way... Buy a heart for my troubles. Now, this part somewhat confused me. The thing is, is that... Um, these look like Din Din's fire things, but in honesty, they're actually the spots where I'm supposed to walk. As I may have noted, that could throw a lot of people off. There's two different ways I can go here. Hmm, but which way to go is the question. Because I really don't want to do the block puzzle again. I really and honestly do not. Right, one of these while I have to be shot at. Wait a minute. These don't move. Are you freaking kidding? Aye. Give me a second. Okay, so apparently that was not the right way to go, and the lens didn't really reveal any thing either. So I'm just gonna go back, get some health. I really want to get this dungeon over with. I want to get, I want to get this over with. I really and honestly do. I'm just finding it very hard to when every way I go is the wrong way. <laughs> But, I'm not getting angry. Nope, nope, not gonna get angry. I think I've pretty much vented enough on my own time as it is. So yeah, not gonna get angry. Not happening. I'll take that. But yeah, the Lens of Truth... Since there's no magic in this quest, it takes money to use. And considering that I already use a lot of money in this quest as it is, that's... I'm kind of eh on that, to be honest. But, I'll roll with it. Plus, on top of that, I'm not entirely sure if I showed the solution to that block puzzle or not. I think I might have, but... Ah, well. Yeah, you can just tick off, stupid Stolfos. Now we just gotta get rid of you. If you just kindly turn around. We're gonna do this the right way this time. I swear to God, I will finish this dungeon one way or, or another. Alright, time to do the block puzzle of doom again. <laughs> I 
first thing to do is to push this one down here. Out. And then this one goes up here. Now we push this one up here and move it over here. I know there's actually a way in Zelda Classic, at least with some of the later versions, that you can actually make it so way, like, some triggers are permanent, that once you trigger them, they're always going to be active afterwards. That would be definitely something I would do here, regarding the matter of, you know, keeping the... Keeping it so you don't have to do the block puzzle every single time you go through. And I'm getting unnecessarily hit here. I reiterate, unnecessarily hit. down here, and over here, and we're done. Alright, you get out of the way. No, 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 no. And another 50 rupees to get through. Alright, lens. Another hidden path. And there's apparently a bomble wall up there, but... How am I supposed to get over to it? Oh, really? I'm gonna guess that bomba wall doesn't lead anywhere. Oh, come on! I was doing so good, too. I honestly hope I have enough rupees to get through here, though. If not, I'm gonna be walking blind. Ow! Okay, I need some more rupees before I can get back through there. Which means I need to do the block puzzle again! Alright, 
I will stop it here for a moment and I'll meet you back when I actually get to where I need to go in that labyrinth, so I'll be right back. <laughs>